What's up everybody? How you guys doing? It's your boy Dad Tom here. We're back with another reaction video. If you have already Q, hit that subscribe button. Really would appreciate it. We're almost at 200 subs. Uh, so, we're doing a 1989 reaction still. Tell us with this time, Out of the Woods. Uh, okay, so as you can see, I'm finally recording on my Lumix camera. It's charged, fully charged. Uh, I want to ask you guys a question. My previous reaction video from this one yesterday, which setup do you guys like more? Do you like that setup or do you like this setup? Let me know in the comments below uh, which one you like more better because I want to make you guys feel a little more comfortable and well, I just want you guys your opinion of what kind of format you guys like my type of recording style, what you want me to do, what you want me not to do. So if you want me to go back and start recording like my previous reaction video let me know in the comments down below if you like it right here then we'll continue doing like this without further ado you guys ready let's dive right into this shall we she lost So basically she was sitting on the couch uh, with uh, another person and she said you took a Polaroid a picture and you discovered the world was black and white. What do you mean the world was black and white? Everything's not in gray. Hmm. Something bad happened? I like the wolves, this concept, or are these foxes? Anyways, let's keep watching. Let's try to get a little bit more information. When she keeps on saying, are we out of the woods, are we getting out of the woods, something similar like that, it kind of reminds me of like, um, maybe she's saying, when are we going to get out of this trap situation that we're in? Because she feels like she's trapped and she's trying to escape, like in this music video, you can even see. Yeah, she said, are we out of the woods? Are we in the clear yet? So, we had to have a clear mind, state of focus, basically. Uh, we can't have any problems in relationships, in life. It's probably talk about their life, what's happening in life, too. Try and break free out of this hellhole they're trapped in. Whatever it's, it's, uh, some scenario is uh, talking about. She just said December. Is she referring to Back to December? That song? I know it was for Taylor Lanther and I am dreading. I can't wait to react to that one. But she said the word December. Remember that. What does that mean? Oh, 
Oh, we were built to fall apart. Damn. So, uh, my guess is that maybe she dated someone in, in this era, like, last December, or maybe during the relationship when they started dating. That was the time she knew that we shouldn't have been together. Hmm, interesting. We fall back together. Fall back together. Huh? Still trying to get my mind around it. Putting the pieces together. Do you know she was in a basically effed up relationship? So she was overthinking and she was just thinking to herself that when we were together, it was like last December. Maybe that some situation happened in December and that escalated. So she said she remembers wearing his necklace. He obviously bought her jewelry. A uh, girl's best friend is the necklace, obviously, of course. She said they moved the couches. Hmm. Was this a romantic relationship? It might have been a romantic relationship. Sometimes romantic relationships... If you get a little too romantic and stuff, it could be a little too much. The other person could be like, Yeah, you're doing a little too much, or we need to cool it and calm down and stuff. So who knows, it could have been a real intimate, real romantic relationship. Those ones, I guess, uh... Don't really work out for certain people, I suppose. Basically, that is the main course. Are you out the woods? Are you out the woods? Are you out the woods? Are you in the clearing? I believe that's the lyrics she was saying right there. She's saying that fast a little bit, but I'm catching it a little slow, a little bit. Okay, let's keep watching. So she talked about they were in a car accident and he got a lot of stitches. She basically stood by his side. He was crying and she was crying with him. Maybe it was like a serious injury and stuff. Like I said, romantic relationships are real passionate and stuff. You care about another person so much, dearly, deeply. You feel and share the same pain the other person does. I walked out, oh, so yeah, there was complications, she walked out, walked out of the relationship.
Yeah, I can hear her pre-recorded voice in here. Like, it's interesting when you hear her pre-recorded voice and stuff in a music video and stuff along when she's singing. Like, we're used to hearing that in lyrics and stuff. Like, when we watch Taylor Swift, react to Taylor Swift's videos and the lyrics, we hear her pre-recorded words over her singing in the song. But here it's interesting. We see her singing and we hear her pre-recorded words along with her singing. It's like basically two voices. It's her and herself. But there's other people actually talking to in a little bit. It's like kind of like a symphony a little bit. lost them, but she found herself, and somehow that was everything. Wow. That was heavy. Okay, I think I got a grip on a little bit more of the situation of what was happening, what was actually going on. This was a romantic relationship status. She lost them. So... Technically, did he? No. I think he broke her heart. Yeah. Something like that. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Other than that, uh, wow. I like that one. That was actually pretty interesting. I like the instrumental behind it too. It was like a slow pace and then it was a fast pace, slow pace, then fast pace, and then make its way up. Um, to go to the movement faster over and over again. It was like repetitive, repeated. I like stuff like that. There's no beat switch in it at all. Or instrumental, like a uh, rhythm beat switch. I didn't hear anything of that right there, but yeah, I liked it. Some three questions with Taylor Swift Fog. Okay, I'm gonna have to watch that <laughs> on my own time. So I get to know her. I know, I know, I'm supposed to react to Selena Gomez, but after this album, I will, okay? Just after his album. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you're new, subscribe to the channel as always. And yes, of course, I'll see you all in the next one.